What is up, internet? My name is Trevor. Um, I am about to do a, a live uncut review of a movie that I just saw at this mo local movie theater. It's called Pacific Rim Uprising, the sequel to Pacific Rim 1, the musical. I'm just kidding, I made that up. Anyways, so Uprising is the sequel to Pacific Rim, and now Pacific Rim has its own universe, because I want to believe that they're making a third, maybe fourth, even more films down the line, because Pacific Rim is based on, like, a graphic novel or a comic book or something. I'm not entirely sure. Don't quote me on anything. If I get anything wrong, it's whatever. Just comment, say whatever you want in the comments below. But this is my uncut spoiler alert review on Pacific Rim Uprising. So, I'm going to just jump right into it, because it is crazy. Alright, so, I'm going to get to the good part first, and that is my favorite character that is from It's Always Sunny in Philadelphia, Charlie Day, who plays Newt. He's, like, part of the Shao Industry um, company. He's, like, buddy-buddy with one of the Asian ladies, and he builds all these drones, uh, and all these drones have the um, kaiju blood in them, and that makes them turn... And they turned into, like, these, like, robotic kaijus. They were, like, drones that had kaiju blood going through them. It was insanity. Okay, so that fight was pretty short, and that was, like, in the middle of the movie. But the end fight was even crazier, because there were three kaijus that came through a breach that the drones opened, basically. So after that epicness after the breach was opened the the three come together the three kaiju form one giant big super kaiju and then <laughs> so the main uh cast uh john boyega and the girl that's with him from the very beginning of the movie they eventually are able to pilot together they had trouble they had a failure before but then they were able to mind meld the whole uh drift thing and then they uh, pretty much finished off the, um, three, three kaiju formed monster, the super kaiju. They were able to, uh, defeat him at that Mount Fuji, uh, location. I keep thinking about the movie that it's going somewhere that I want to go, but it, I wasn't sure the direction of where it was going to go. By the way, the cinematography in this movie are, is, this felt like very, like, Japanese anime Oh, I want to point out, there was actually a Gundam, uh, like a stone Gundam statue in, when they were, like, filming in that area. I don't know if that was, like, actually based on an actual real place in the real world, but there was a Gundam, uh, nod in this movie that was pretty, uh, interesting when they showed that part. Um, other, I wanted to mention, oh yeah, so Newt basically is, like, the villain going towards the end he it's like the emissary for the precursors and the precursors are the people that are basically behind the creation of the kaiju and the breaches and everything related to that so at the very end of uprising you see newt saying that <laughs> they're gonna come back or something but then jake uh jake pentecost son of the other pentecost idris elba he says that they're going to go straight to them. They're going to bring the war or the fight to the kaiju uh, origin place, location, whatever it is. It's going to be like Pacific Rim War for the third one. That's what I'm hoping. That's what I might... I'm curious how it's going to like play out and everything. But, um, yeah, so there's my spoiler review. I um, also wanted to mention that... Um, and, and, I had a feeling that Guillermo del Toro didn't really have that much of a part of it, but he is actually a producer on this film. And that's another reason why I love the original film, is that it's uh, helped produced by Guillermo del Toro. And I love that pen. It was an inspiration, and the reason why I want to get into filming and everything related to film in general. Other than that, I'm going to be bringing up some more videos for this channel, so stick around, stay tuned. This has been a short to medium length review of Pacific Rim Uprising. I would say it's a must-see. You should take your friends, your family, anybody you care about. I would say I would share this story to anyone, really. <laughs> Anyways,
peace out. My name is Trevor. Stay subscribed, stay tuned, and talk to me in the comments below. Laters.